at Bonji. Welcome to Zodan V Talks. My name is Idiene. I am the People's Bay. It's a beautiful day because we're shooting from Woodland Stadium. I'm sure you know what that means. You know what that means. Yes, I know you know. But before, you, in case you don't know and you want to know, subscribe. Make sure you leave a comment. Make sure you like and invite people to like our channel. Come on, man. Subscribe, subscribe. I'm hanging out with the one and only, the only surviving KK. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, <laughs> Kangwa. <laughs> Welcome to ZMB Talks. Thank you. Nice to see you. Yes. I'm looking forward. Looking forward to what I have to ask. Yeah. Yeah? You know why I'm happy? It's the first soccer player we have on this show. Yeah? Yeah. It's what you play in the JH episodes. J. <laughs> first athlete to make it on ZMB Talks. First footballer. Yeah, welcome. Thank you. Do you watch this show? Of course. Yes, I'm a huge fan, of course. Which 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 episode have you seen that you like? A lot of, like of like five, five of them. They are my favorites. <laughs> it is, what does this mean? Mm, I'll tell you after the show. Why? No, it's uh, the meaning is my faith will not fail me. My faith will not fail me. Oh, your faith will not fail you. Yes. Oh, that's an, oh, that's like yeah. <laughs> and when did it start? Mm. I think five months, five, six months ago. For real? Yes. We're at Woodland Stadium. Have you played in the stadium? Yet? Of course. This is my home ground. This is your home ground? Yes. Is this where everything started? No, but I've been here also. Mm. Yeah. What team were you playing for when you were playing? Apiats. Apiats. Yes. Do you go back to Monaco Field? What's happening? Of course, yeah. Oh, how long did you play for Apiats? Four years. Four years? Four years. I was reading something, eh? And it says you actually even scammed was younger. Yeah. Biological. Not he? biological, but same father, different mom. For real? Yeah, so it's, we are brothers. <laughs> <laughs> Someone is a shoe shop, a man. Oh, but, a family, man. <laughs> <laughs> I won't say who, but that ah, way. No, we'll but feel. it's very difficult to understand, you know? Mm. Oh, even if he's here, you can tell that, okay, we are brothers because. The yeah, I think I can play, even the similarities. Even the, yes, you know. yeah, we look alike, yeah. And we, we have been always together every time. Same team. What same, team was that? Uh, uh, like my current club now in uh, Arsenal Club. Oh, so hey, together, someone yeah. was like, I would know. It's just because even from come to Russia, they're not brothers. No, but only the closest one, they they know like they the know. story. Yeah. So you, you, you weren't really offended when they made the type like um, an error when they say when you scored mm -hmm. in your game here, then they say even scamble. I saw that, but I think uh, yes, they made mistake, but uh, I think it's not a huge one mm -hmm. because even if they say even no problem, no problem. Your family, you know? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You feel like I'm yes, right. if as, as long as plus we are going to feel Yeah, yeah. <laughs> as soon as Tula. Yeah. Oh, that was in Russia. Mm -hmm. So now before we actually so get to that, eh? Yeah. Um. I saw your post when you said Zambia, this is your win. Even you, you know that we needed that win. You know, okay, let me say the situation and the people sad, the fans also with the prayers and the pressure which was coming from the management, you know, obvious they have been receiving the pressure from the fans and the different guys. Mm. So Plus, we lost the first game against Ivory Coast. So, mm. obviously, everyone, the morale, the, the face was down. Mm. So, we came home to fight and to try to change the situation. Mm. So, definitely, we really needed that win. Mm. And uh, that's why I said the win was for the people of Zambia. And it was only after that moment that a lot of people said to realize that Akansha Shama Free Kiki actually good. Now, yeah. instead of going back to your page, you know, your socials, yeah, just yeah. to see, like, oh, it's actually good. This, You've yeah. been doing this. So, like, you're just good when it comes to free kicks. Yeah, I'm good. Set how, pieces, I'm very good. How did you start? How did you realize that? Uh, I think when I was young, I knew. I saw one, two, three shots. Mm. Then I was like, I, I think I can be good, so I have to start working on this. Mm. And from then, I became good and good and good. And good. Now yes. you're like, like a dancer too. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like a dancer. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what's, what's, I know you're a midfielder. Yes. What's your favorite position? If you're not a midfielder, what, what position would you love to have played? Left winger. Why? I think I'm good also as a left winger because I like dribbling. So 
Mm. I can do one or two things, you know? Wow. Yeah. Which players did you grow up watching? Cristiano, mm-hmm. of course. Messi, of course. Mm-hmm. Uh, Rooney. Okay, mm. just to say, to mention a few. I'm, I'm disappointed and surprised that because David Beckham, I mean, we all know Beckham. Cause yeah, of course. Oh, yeah, of course, Beckham. I've been watching Beckham. Even now, I'm still watching his uh, highlights on YouTube. Beckham. For real? Kaka, of course. Kaka. Just how to improve your yes, skill. Yes, just to see. Okay, I was young by then, but now we, still, we have videos, we have YouTube you can watch mm. and you can learn something from these guys. Mm-hmm. And oh. I just remember like two months I was watching Beckham at home, you know? Sometimes oh. when I have nothing to do, I just switch on my TV and I put, okay. I search maybe Hazard also, I like to watch Hazard because oh, yeah. we have some media dribbling stuff. Mm-hmm. So you improve. play both legs? Yeah. Left, right. Because yes, my right. players when I'm good, but can figure check left at that time. I'm gone. <laughs> then when I come left, you can figure out right. You're like, ah, forget about that. Yeah, I know. I play both. I can use. You're comfortable with both. Yeah, both mm. I'm from Kasama, but I've never been to Kasama. Also, I'm from Kasama. Have you lived in Kasama? Yes, but I was a little young. No, ah, yes. so you didn't really play. In Kasama. Yes, no, no. So where did the football career start? I think here in Osaka. No. Mm-hmm. What team was that? It was uh, Maken Youth. I played for two youth academies. It was in Kanyama and Maken Youth. Mm. Yeah. Kanyama. Kanyama. What team was that? Uh, Benjamin FC. Mm-hmm. Then from there, I, uh, one of the white guy took me mm. to his club mm. in Maken. Oh. That's how I shipped from Maken. Then from Maken, I came to Apiat. Are you still with the same white guy? No. Oh, so he just started it. Yeah, he started, and some other guys they come to continue and continue. And then, ah, and the national team, when did you join the national team? National team, it was in 2018. I I went in camp to under 20. Under 20? Yes. That's when they called you. Yes, and before the, they called you. Before they called you, what team were you playing? I was in Israel. You were in Israel. Yeah. How did you find you in Israel, please? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> yes, uh, by the same football. Mm. I think I was, I can say I was good. So it's So why from I, Happy Arts, you went to Israel? Yes, from Happy Arts, I went to Israel. Then from Israel, I came back to Zambia. I joined Butecom. Then Butecom, mm. I stayed like uh, six, seven months. Then mm. I moved to Russia. Wow, you're so blessed. Seven months, then pew, yeah. you're picked. Pew. Oh. <laughs> do you have an agent yeah, or are you yeah, doing this yeah. alone? No, I have an agent. So they just put at that. Uh, yeah. I think. Yes. Very <laughs> <they call. laughs> <laughs> This is the one. So tell me the moment you were called to play for the national team. Was it something you've always wanted? Of course. I think it's a dream of every soccer player, you know? The dream is to play. The dream is to represent your the country mm. and uh, also to wear the t-shirt. It's, mm. it's, it's, the feeling is amazing, I'm telling you. Mm. Yeah, so I was excited and I was like, Lily, is this true? Is it true? I have to go now. You know, they are saying you, I should go tomorrow. Then me, I'm saying, why not today? Why not? <laughs> <laughs> why not today? Yes. Oh yeah, were you not scared? No, I was excited to to meet the guys and even to wear the same jazz, you know? Mm. Yeah. Was it hard for you to prove to the judges that you deserve this? No, it wasn't uh, very hard. I think I was like, the first training, uh, yeah, it was amazing and everyone was like, wow, what a guy, what a player. For real? Then from then, I, it was uh-huh. just smooth, you know, like we're drinking uh, apple juice. And like I'm drinking yeah. apple juice. <laughs> <laughs> so you love apple juice? Of course. Kaziva, man. Yeah. What else doesn't miss in your fridge? Mm. Uh, apple juice, mm-hmm. orange juice, mm-hmm. water, of course. Mm-hmm. And uh, yeah, I think these are my favorite drinks. Mm-hmm. Okay, so you don't literally don't drink alcohol as well. At all. For I've real? never tried, yeah. Is it because it's, it's a it's a club policy? No. Or it's just something you've always uh, I think I'm I'm not interested. I think it's because you've played with your older brother. Not yes, but still even when I was alone, still I, I never tried. Hmm. Yeah. Playing football with your older brother. Yeah, it's amazing, I'm telling you. Aye. Yeah. How I, I can't describe that feeling because my sister and I don't. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but yeah, it's good. Oh yeah, mm-hmm. which 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 Zambian player would you say, or which Zambian teammates would you say you're really close with? You check up on each other. 
yeah, I think uh, we are in touch with so many guys. Yeah. And of course, I like to be found with the young one because I'm only an academic, so I'm always with the Nice. What academy is that? Uh, is the academy is based in Kanyama. Nice. Uh, so I'm always the small guys mixed, and also the guys which are playing Premier League. Also, we are in touch. Mm. We talk a lot with so many guys. Ah, yeah. what? How did you start your academy? I mean, you're so young. Yes, I think I'm so young. I'm still young, but you know, for now I can start even if I'm not that hundred percent focused in the academy. But we can start step by step. Mm. Then uh, you have a heart for Kenya, Mike. Yes, because that's what everything. I think started. when I was young, I was like, I think I've I've been looking like the people are suffering. You know, obvious. You know, the, mm. the life in Zambia and in Africa. So I was like, if I make it. Mm. Open an academy and start helping these guys. How many kids do you have? All age, like eight, ten, twelve, sixteen, up to twenty coming down. Up to let's say from twenty coming Fair down. Enough. What's your plan for this? Okay. The plan is to help the young kids, the young players, to maybe to put them in the system, mm. and the, obviously some of them they are good. So the target is to help them, and who knows? Mm. Tomorrow we want to see them. They are the Chipolope future stars and what what is the academy see. called? King Soccer Academy. King Soccer Academy. So it's like my name, but it's King. Ah. Yeah, so King, you know, it means a lot. Ah, yeah, yeah King Soccer Academy. Yeah. Oh, the best King Thank Soccer you. Academy. <laughs> <laughs> you know, sometimes it looks easier because we as supporters, yeah. we just see people playing, but we don't know the hard work that you're putting in. Mm-hmm. Especially now that Polo Polo is like, when you when you lose, you face a lot of backlash. Yes. You win and you say, we really, really needed this win. What is it like every time that you're playing? And you know, when we're expecting a lot from you guys. If chance with my vote, I was my winner sometimes. You know, football is tricky. Football is a game of chance. Football, the teams that is going to give everything, the team that is going to sacrifice and play good, they have 90% of winning the game, mm. you know? So coming back to say, to your question, like you expecting us to win every time, I think sometimes also maybe we we also want to win. We are working hard to give you the victories to make you happy. But sometimes uh, it's a game. You have to understand also. Sometimes okay. Yes, I get it. You're not really supposed to win all the time. Yes, but but I could see that the previous game, this one, yeah. you people, you showed that. We really needed exactly. this, and that's why you won. Yes. But your attitude towards every game sometimes, it's not usually like Yeah, that. it's true. We need to change. We need to change. We need to change the game plan. And mm. also, we need to, to... Maybe I think we need to work a little more harder than mm. before. Especially in these games, we need to work. We need to stick to each other. We need to help each other. And we need to to be together in every situation. That's because, true. Because now we have been missing, I think, three seasons without playing. Uh, Afcon, so you fans, mm. you're upset. <laughs> you are you are leaving want us now <laughs> this time to go. So also with the team we have been talking to say guys now it's too much. Mm. We don't have any excuse to give the people and mm. the management and the fans. So let's go and fight. Let's go and show the fighting spirit and mm. we'll see what will happen. And we really saw that fighting spirit. Yes. So I, I think we need to continue like that. As I was saying, you're lacking experience. That's why you, mm, most of these games, you people don't really seem to be come out victorious. I don't think so. You yes, maybe experience. one, two players. We need one, two big players. But we are all smart. Mm. Almost if you see our team, everyone is playing in Europe. Mm. So which experience you want? Mm. Our, but we are playing in Europe, so it's just the mentality. We need to know how to react. We need to know how to change the situation. We need to know how to lead the game. Mm. Yeah, you're playing for Belgrade, right? Yes. In in, in is this Serbia? In Serbia. Yeah. So now, is it easy for you to apply the knowledge and experience you are, you, you get in that side to apply it in the team? Yes, I think also from the also I think the logo prayers they can learn also we learn from the local prayers you know mm. because football it's about learning it's about learning and giving respect so i have to bring that winning mentality that skill that attitude 
from there to go into this team and the other guys they bring they bring when we mix together mm. like see you know you're playing for a team you said yeah how do you manage to still be you can really skillful eh? and others say nah, we'll find out why you can say more and get some more and get some more fun now you get it mm-hmm. but then how do you manage to still be good and still have that respect for some players no i yes i think football is a game of chance so if you if you are not starting today accept and wait your moment if the coach say okay today i'm starting with edina fine accept that and stay focused mm-hmm. just be late i'm pretty sure you'll be given the time so once also you take that chance use mm-hmm. it wise and make sure to keep that position when they give you a chance mm-hmm. so that that has been in my mind always mm, nice you know i think i've got it no. you know we, we have a culture that we, we do here before we start our interviews guys right you look like that player that's always praying in the dressing room before a game yes i think i'm a believer yeah so it's true mm. i always ask the help from god because mm. this gift without him i'm nothing true yeah what are you seeing yourself in the next three years uh by that time I'll be playing top league come on <laughs> <laughs> so the top league I'll be as this top 5 in the world like say England France mm-hmm. German mm-hmm. Italy mm-hmm. and uh, yeah the top uh, top 5 what's a dream club what's pass Tottenham Tottenham yeah. for real yes. why Tottenham I like the team I like the style of play are you seeing yourself going there Yes. So you're a Tottenham fan? Yes. You support Tottenham? I support Tottenham. Also, I support United. Manchester United. Yeah. Yay! <laughs> Come on! <laughs> yeah, yeah! <laughs> but the part was really rough. Yeah, it was mm. a very difficult season. Yeah. It was a difficult season, eh? So as, 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 I'll ask you as an individual, yeah. right? But I know, yes, it's, you also play for the team. Yeah. But what is it that we genuinely need to improve? for us to go to the AFCO because we've seen how other players are, how other teams are playing. Yeah. I think first of all we need to like we need to to be very organized. We need to be very serious in terms of uh, management and the, we need to give the support to the coaches. Mm. We need to give them chance to do what they want. Mm. And also they need time like For example, if you have a game next month, mm. at least we should try to give them huge time so that they can prepare everything and make everything on press mm. instead of just and you have two games in two weeks, then you come after a week. It's not enough. Mm. So they need you need to give them time and every material that is needed. Then from there, I think we won't have any excuse. Mm. Yeah. Nice. That's that's nice. You know, one thing I've also noticed. We, the fans, when we hear our way, they're playing for home. I think yeah. it's high time we also show that. Does that give you guys morale, exactly. right? Yeah, I give you an example. The game we played in Ivory Coast. Mm. You I saw that, man. Yeah, <laughs> it was a crazy, crazy, crazy. And also the players was like, look, our Zambian fans, mm. you always comment when you see something wrong. When the team lose, you comment. You comment. You know, oh, this, that, that, that. But now, This is the time we need to stick together. Okay, before we talk about before we talk about the fans, eh? This is just something like yeah. a light moment. How do you feel when you see my posters at Tamba Bona which put put the jersey, they put the BB machine. <laughs> <laughs> They'll put me this Yeah, yeah, you know it's fun. Like it's fun. You know it's fun before the game maybe on phone and you just saw this uh, yeah. <laughs> You can laugh but uh, we don't put in the mind. Mm. You know and also that shows that you don't trust us yes yes i accept that the people the fans they don't trust us because we have been not winning which is it's true you can lose the the faith uh, the hope so now we we was talking with the team now it's a uh, the right time to stick together and mm-hmm. try to start winning so that we can gain the support and the respect from the fans i think you just need to gain our trust exactly back. we need now to gain the trust back because i I best believe the next t- game you're going to play home yes. the fans are going to show up yes. so and i noticed that from ivory coast 
those people turned out in numbers. Exactly, yeah. Especially the second half when Zid Zaha entered, yes, you guys were confused. Exactly, you know, he just controlled the game. I can't feel like But here, yeah, the people they are waiting you to make mistakes yes. so that they can comment yes. or shout. I you saw know? that. Yeah. How was that? Let's talk about that moment. <laughs> I'm sure you people never expected him to go in in the second half. You had that thing of uh, yeah, maybe he'll start. Maybe he'll start, yeah. but then he didn't end up starting, right? Yeah, but for me, I don't pay attention to who is playing, who am I playing against? No, mm. there's no way you have to concentrate on yourself. Mm. You have to look on your team, even if they pray, even if you pray Cristiano or who, but most important is yourself. If you do good, you give everything, you have chance to win. Mm. So I guess we didn't give enough work in Ivory Coast. And in the end, that's why we lost. And we accepted that. We came back home, we refresh, we go again. Mm. I love that. I think you people accepted it. And the hunger that you showed us, please exactly. just carry yeah, on. Yeah, football and you lose, you have to accept. Because you can't turn that back. You know? Mm. You can't bring that game again. It's gone. So we move now. What's uh, We move to the next assignment mm. yeah. i love what you say like you don't really care who you're playing against yes. because it's all about yourself yes. right but i'm sure sometimes when you're playing against these big teams ghana what what after the game you're like wait did i just play against that guy you also have such moments so senegal then you're like wait did i just play senegal yes i think i'll talk about on my about myself yes yes, yes. Yeah, i can know that, okay i'm playing against uh, these top teams mm-hmm. but once the game started i'm inside mm-hmm. like everything goes out mm-hmm. i don't know if it's, i'm playing home i just concentrate and try to enjoy myself what do you do on your free day like it's like this on the sunday yes yeah, i love playing fifa a lot you can't beat me at fifa you know that yes you can't beat me sorry you don't know what you're saying <laughs> <laughs> i think one of the sports is open somewhere yes. here. we can go play fifa yeah we can try one one, one game one game. Pro- one game just one game yes. what team do you use any any team I only have three teams that I use. Dream player you'd love to play with in the future? Mm, I would like to play with Kelvin De Bruyne. Mm. Also Cristiano, but I think he's old. But there's two of time I can find him. You know? In two years' time or one year, I find him. We can play together. Oh, yeah. yeah. I love that. <laughs> and speaking about Cristiano being old, again, another thing that the streets are talking about is why is it that all the, the, all the older guys that used to play football are no longer there. Would, would you say that has also affected the performance of the team? I think yes, because most of the old, old pro players, mm. they are not doing fine. Only few. Only few. I give you an example. Let's say to the, the, the other teams like Ivory Coast, we saw like five, six players. Mm. They played 2012 and they are still doing yes. good. Okay. So why should you leave them? You have to call them. But our players, if you tell me, we have, I think, three or four. Mm. You see? So that's. Who is playing active football? Like active, like good football. Like mm. active. But people like Suzu, Suzu can Yes, play, like right? I said, the few Suzu, Kennedy, yes, Mr. Kennedy. Who else? Yeah. Nathan. Mm. Nathan. Who, who else? You see? Mm. We are few. I get it. I get it. I get it. Have you ever been top scorer of something? Yeah, I came up as a top scorer this season in Arsenal too. Come on! <laughs> <laughs> Come on! Yeah. What are some of the challenges playing, you know, as an African playing for these countries? This uh, it's always difficult from the start. Because you need to get adapt, you need to, to know the food, you need to know the weather and the life. So from the start, it's always difficult. But once you get used and you adapted, everything will start going smooth. Mm-hmm. So even me, before it was like this, then after I knew everything now, I was the boss in the end. Yeah, you know yeah. the boss boss. <laughs> <laughs> so you're alone in Serbia? Yeah, I'm alone. Your, brother, your, your older brother is in Russia? Yes. Oh, you're not scared? Don't no. you people fear like I'm moving into a country that I don't even know? Yes, but when you're with God, nothing is impossible. True. Yeah, I so love you that. Always move with God. I love that. I love that. And how do you find it? You know, just talking to people, especially from different nations. Yeah. The language barriers. So how do you manage to be yourself? Mm, first of all, you don't need to pretend. You have to be yourself. Even if you go in Brazil or in Africa, you have to be yourself. 
if you don't know you don't know if you know you know mm. so obvious is to be smart and to know how to to react and how to handle the situation mm. that can't i know it's so difficult it's difficult to like when you are new to the country it's not easy because you need to know the language you don't know the food the life and also the place so from the start not to be home after training you go home nice how many goals did you score as a you are the champion of six in how many games in 21 games no yes 21 games six goals six goals six assists six goals six assists na flo kunsa ndanga mabipa Ah, that's dope. That's actually dope. Nanga ka dance za kaka nka bwanja. Eh, this ka dance ya ka. Nzere mfana then ni mstamba tu mabungu kwa mbele mtu mabungu. So kwa mungu nzo ka konda then one guy used to to do the same dance. Na na bona ka kopela ya daka. Gangster inspire me I did the same dance here in Lucas Stadium. You like, did it. Yeah. I remember yes. What game was what game was it? Uh, it was against National Assembly. I scored free kick also. A free kick. Yeah. You're pretty good at free kicks. I saw that short clip. <laughs> yeah. mm, how did you how okay, let's say someone also wants to be like you. Apaka italiko inda kuni mapears bila tini na watu wakae. So if someone wants to be like you, what do they need to improve on to be a good free kick? What? Free kick, yeah. Free, free kick taker. Free kick taker, yeah. I think uh, even if you are not good, but if you start learning, you start uh, trying to shoot. Maybe after training, you shoot one, two, three shots. You know, you can. The idea will come. So let's say if you know how to shoot, you have a good shoot. Then you keep on working on that. Mm. Definitely, you'll be good. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So just keep on working and improving. Yeah. Can we can we go check if if those guys are being so we play our No problem. Cool. We're going to <laughs> let's see what's happening inside guys. Yeah, but now it's Okay. Yeah. <laughs> guys, somebody just got some and I'm waiting for someone to show some my PlayStation. <laughs> 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 you got them. No, in the PlayStation in our room. Ah. So I will come with the PlayStation if you play. I wish I told you to say come with ah, the yeah, PlayStation. Ah, yeah, yeah. Me I have the new one. Ah, you better go. FIFA in it. Eight. 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 Okay. So now, mm-hmm. did you did you know you're going to score that goal? Yeah, free kick. Yeah. Oh, my free kick. My target and my I think what I do is if I manage if the ball passed the those guys on the hole it's definitely go. Oh yeah. Yeah. So uh I have to make sure those guys they don't block that ball. Mm. If they don't it's a go. Then it's a go. Yeah. If they do then uh, okay. So you any target it's a go. Yes. Ah, because I I know the places where to put, you know. Mm. Even if I put there, yes, it can save, but it would be okay, good shoot. Yeah. yeah. Your favorite Zambian player? You told me about Sungu, but the Zambian. Zambian. Mm-hmm. It's difficult to choose. I know. <laughs> because see, after the end of someone who come at you, my my ch- my I know your brother is definitely one of your favorite players. But yes. Mm-hmm. Oh, yes but yes is my brother but uh, not uh, not as my favorite mm. you know when you have to be straight like i told you like you have to be straight mm. <laughs> so who's like your favorite <laughs> <laughs> i i'll go for myself <laughs> okay your best zambian footballer of all times i'll go with the uh, I think Renford was good. Renford Calabria. Yeah, it was good. Why? Although he never played in top leagues, but I think I it don't know why it. he never played, but I think he was good. Yeah. Also Christopher was good. I like the fighting spirit. Mm. He wasn't that technical like we are now, but he was you know he can fight, he can mm. command, he can score. This is good also. Yeah. yeah. All right, Clink, thank you so much. I don't know why I was even scared to reach out. I was like, mm, never. Mm. But I'm for fact to Look at that my interview. So I was even shocked you saying okay, yeah. Why didn't you deny? No, nah, no, I think me like I told you me I'm a straight guy so when I say 
Yes, it's yes. Yeah. When I say I'm busy, I'm busy. As a kappa, he'll change his mind. He'll be like, I know. No, you know what? But in Kotaka, something. So. All right. Thank you so much. What, what would you, what would be like your last words to, to the people, your soccer fans, out in the Zambian soccer fans, and also people from Serbia, your new team? Yeah, I think I can just say, uh, as usual, thank you for the support mm. in bad times and in, in good times. And also a big thank you to you for, for the invitation. You're and uh, looking forward to have more of this. Uh-huh. And uh, myself, looking forward to go and succeed to go and have a good success with the new team. With the new team. Yeah. All the best. Thank you. Now, long I just remembered. Uh, of course. Eh? <laughs> <laughs> it's a must. It's a must. Yeah. Right. Thank you so much, everybody who's been supporting ZNB Talks. We are taking it. Quiz, sir. Ciao, Lord. Don't yeah. forget to leave this comment, subscribe, and like. Mwah. Ciao. Yeah.